Hey guys, welcome back to Sonic Unleashed, and today we're going to start asking around the town of Apotos, see if anyone knows Chip. So, those guys don't know who he is. And now we're going here. Yeah. These are like the hub worlds in Sonic Unleashed. And not the HD version, because the HD version are actually interactive and you can walk around them. This one's more like point and click stuff. I actually think it's better that way because it goes a little faster. Because you can skip text better and, you know. I mean, isn't that entertaining, but. And yeah, I clicked around the wrong place. Here, so. Click around like. Yeah, I used to pointer. That's better. Um, and you see here. Sky. There's a gnome, yeah. So, yeah. Try. Yeah. Yeah, switch way. <laughs> and edge of town. What do you mean we can't go inside? Forget that. We're going in there. We're going deep, deep, deep inside. Oh, yeah. Sun. So. And we get the sun tablet. First conference. Okay, this one I'll have to explain. Um. Actually, no, I'll explain this later, because it'll be a little one point there. But I'll say, when you get a Sun Tablet, you're going to be playing as Sonic the Hedgehog. When you get a Moon Tablet, you're going to be playing as another character, which we did see, but we haven't been able to play as yet. This place is kind of spooky, huh, Sonic? If it was yeah, just me, voice. I'd be too scared to go in. That door's glowing, Sonic. Yeah, he doesn't talk much in the later game, though, so at least there's that. And now let's go in there. Alright, now, uh, so let's just see here. So now, Potos one mile day stage. Two, one, go! So, uh, at <laughs> uh, I'm not used to the controls I haven't played in a while. I didn't do a practice run, which I probably should have, but, eh, you know. Unscripted. That's sort of me for you. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> yeah, it gets annoying when I says, woo! Like that. And I just missed that item. Oh, well. I'm not that good at Sonic playing as Sonic in head. I'm not good at playing as Sonic the Hedgehog. And uh, look at that. How did I do that? How did I do that? Someone tell me how I did that. There we go. Woohoo. Z. I actually did it that time. I got another one coming. Uh -oh. Spring. Just attacking these guys, just going in there. And more attacking. And now. Yeah, these data models are pretty fun. And you know, these sequences where you gotta press the buttons right in order to get up to a higher platform, and uh. Yeah, one thing I don't like about the boost is that sometimes it like takes away your control. At least going so fast it's like almost impossible to actually steer him. And besides. Sonic game should be at speed, but if it's all if speed is all you're doing, then you'd be better off playing like a racing game. Not a Sonic racing game though, unless it's Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing. Because every other Sonic racing game is very bad. Sonic Drift, Sonic R. Ugh. Yeah. You'd be better off playing Sonic and Sega All Stars Racing and ah fail. Yeah, that just goes to show. I'm not good at daytime missions. Although I do really like them. And, uh. Whee! Jump. Just going fast. Collecting as many rings as you can. Oh, yeah, that level up thing you might have seen earlier. It basically just extends how many boosts you can hold. The game does have some RPG elements to it, but not with regular Sonic. Uh, 
Here we go. Uh. Thank you, Mr. Captain Obvious. <laughs> yeah. They sometimes, like, throw a robot at you and you have to quick step dodge it. I'm not too huge of a fan of these portions. But, you know, they're there, right? Okay. And you can destroy it. Although, I don't think I've actually ever been able to destroy it. Using the boost really won't speed things up a bit. At least I don't think it will. <laughs> so, you know, just keep attacking it. And you missed. Oh, I missed. I should not reference other people like that. And attack. And... Actually, you can destroy him. I didn't realize that before. And I probably won't do it again for a while. And... That's it with the level. Stage clear. And yeah, there we go. A rank. But it's not the highest rank. The highest rank you get is S rank. As for Sonic, I guess. Duh. And those are things you get from those question mark items. Not gonna get all of them. This is not 100%. Um, normally, in a level, there's one daytime stage, and after that, follow missions, which are in the daytime level, such as collecting rings, getting to a certain place far enough, and new moves, stuff like that. And that is trying to accelerate upon boost. And I'm not good at that. I'm not sure when I get it right. <laughs> and I failed to do something right there. We jump. And yeah. So here we gotta collect 100 rings. And then it's as simple as that. Because once we do that, it'll be over. Yeah, if you see, ever see a chain of enemies like that, then you're gonna wanna actually pony attack them. It's probably in your best interest. A baby. Actually, going up here probably isn't the best idea. What you're probably gonna wanna do is act because that spring is there. So you're probably actually gonna wanna go down there. Yeah, look at this. So, I'm just restarting now. Yeah, embarrassing. Actually, no, I'm not restarting it. Because I must said I might as well fail. <laughs> so why don't I cut this part out and I'll see you guys when I actually succeed. Not my best one. Okay, I'm back. 66, now 78 rings in hand. And now I intentionally fail, so I go down here, take the better route. And now I get successfully go up here and get these rings so I can the mission. That was unnecessarily not cool. Unnecessarily not cool. I'm a king of vocabulary. And tablet bag with a red jewel. Uh, those are important for later. I will explain that later. Cutscene. anyone who knows me don't worry about it maybe your memory will come back on its own remember anything yet <laughs> nope. oh well oh. Sonic <gasps> Yeah, that probably could have been transitioned a little better. Whoa, Mr. Monster Guy is back. So when the sun goes down, I turn into this. Are you okay, Sonic? I'm fine. 
I just need to be careful who sees me like this. sounds like Shadow when he's in that Sonic, form. Sonic, look. I don't know. It's kind of something I think. Oh, it's hopeless. The whole planet is split apart. We're doomed. Oh. Mister? Oh. Hey, mister. Hey, don't cry. Uh, ice cream. How about some more of this super tasty stuff? What good is ice cream at a time like this? Mm. Oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Sonic, your arm just stretched. Is that biologically possible? But it could be useful. What? Why did you use the stretching arms to slap some sense in him? Literally, yeah. Like that. And now we're at nighttime in the village. It's basically the same thing, you just interrogate people. Uh, same thing. Gotta look for the same things. <laughs> yeah, a lot of people are scared by our werehog. By this their art form. This is called the werehog, by the way. People are scared by our werehog form. Get it? Werewolf, hedgehog, werehog. Yeah. Yeah. Yellow fox. Uh, we know yellow fox. Tails. No tails. Could tails be around here somewhere? Yeah, yellow fox. That would be tails. So, the werehog kind of looked different. And, and we got the moon tablets. You know, I'll explain it. When you receive um, a sun tablet in a village, you will be playing as Sonic the Hedgehog. And if you receive a moon tablet, you'll be playing a song like the Werehog. And, um... And it's another gimmick. It is... Um, actually, we'll get into that later. But, you know, if Sonic's in light, he will be a hedgehog, but darkness will make him Werehog. Huh? Hey! You're back to nice What, guys, monsters so aren't again. night? This light's monsters so aren't nice? It kind of feels like the afternoon sun. Do you think your transforming's got something to do with the sun, Sonic? <laughs> Didn't he, know. like, say that? That's... That door's glowing, Sonic. Maybe that means it'll open now. Let's go see. And... Now we open up the new door. And... Now we're... Scary guy again. All scary again. Don't you get tired of Don't you all think the time? it's his don't you think it's not his choice? <laughs> Alright. Uh, that's enough for today as pretending soon. So next time on Let's Play Sonic Unleashed, we are going to start playing as Sonic the Werehog.